shit. <laughs> this way, Papa. Come and see. Will it hatch? Can we take it home? Yes, my darlings. Of course we can take it home. No, we're not taking it. It's a person's body? Found a sword? came up out of the ground while she lay on the grass asleep like serpents they were and they burrowed into his ears and became his listenings. Alright, uh two seconds. Dear sweet lord of all that is good and holy, I must make my escape, grasp this container and its future contents and flee this place before that creature that near Nearly man returns. Wait for the church. Surely such an abomination could not follow on to hollow ground. Be surprised. We sat here. I remembered we sat in our black. And we mourned and we prayed and we bowed our heads. How oh, I hated God when I spurned him. If this is our Lord, 
This pig who robs me of my wife, then I refute his embrace. I will carve a new god for us all. Such madness, such as such a fool I was. If such blasphemous ravings had remained with me, I would be doomed. But even here, I feel the machine throb beneath the flags, and I know my path awaits me. Alright, um, I'm gonna get some tea. I will be back in a few seconds. I'm back. Delivery schedule. I never heard that. How in blazes are we supposed to meet these damn schedules? Is it even the basic equipment we have provided but simply will not perform as it doesn't? Uh, I did read that. Son of a bitch. Alright, that isn't creepy at all.
steps up. Twin candles bent to the will of the central saint. Casting their light into the corners of the chapel, Father Jeremiah thought I thought could be trusted with the secret. But he is like all the others. So the old priest has gone to the holding pens with his flock. He says he will never enter into our world with them. A shepherd indeed. this place because holy shit Your faith shackles your vision, Professor. It is an iron coffin that keeps you from grasping the future. We require a new deity, one of steam and the wheel of magnetism and progress. The old god is nothing more than a lamed hog, spitting back offal at mankind. Uh -huh. Tones of that place. Uh, 
air gauges. Ugh. Fires of flames are stoked to hear steam from the walls, vibrations upon the very air, my heart falters at the prospect of throwing a lever and exposing the workings of this dark contraption. With my children beckon me on and I cannot fail them. I have no choice thus I descend and may God have mercy upon my soul that this is my bedlam and I am the cast as Matthews then I will wear the mantle for the sake of my boys and face whatever horrors lie beneath the altar. Thing. 
much burnt that is. That's not too bad. That's dark as shit. Shit, shit. <laughs> So the soaking pulling cockroaches now sneezed into the handkerchief on the desk out into his eyes. I have begun to change more rapidly now. He surmised. So far, I still think the first amnesia came was scary. Not being able to look at it, I think made it worse. has some moments so far, but... Nothing like the first one. Having to manage the oil and your tinder boxes. Water in his shoes. Always the water and the sparks of the embers of the wheels. It's too bony. It's too damn bony. I wish I still had the recordings of the first one. Of the first one when I played it. My soul shudders at what I've seen. Last, I have reached the main part of the factory and now onwards downwards to find those flood waters and drain them away. Like Moses, I will cleave the waters and lift my little darlings clear of this vile cradle. This one scared the shit out of me. So, there. 
These men, Professor, these so-called men of vision, they would shackle the masses to a wheel and turn it till their backs break. All for that opiate, the lure of profit. These fools who lackey them, these priests, these officials, this government. They make pigs of us all. But what solution, my dear man? How to break a cycle? You cannot simply remove the promise of a better world for these unfortunates. In the workhouses, in the orphanages, the belief in heaven is surely the only sucker one can find. We do not need to wait. We can bring forth paradise now. We can speed the passion. With only a small sacrifice, we can hold the apocalypse. With just a small sacrifice, we can free our shackles and deliver them to paradise now. I gotta light up. Oh. Huh. It's already lit. When I played the first one, I was I was screaming and freaking out. It was... I mean, the whole fear of the thing was you didn't really know what the hell it looked like because you couldn't look at it. I understand they're trying new things here, but... Alright. Shh, fuck you. Yeah. Couldn't look at the thing, you had to run, you could actually hide. What the hell? It ran this way, where the hell did it go? Because it should have looped back around to me. Sneaky pig. Like in this one, you can't hide in anything. I'm thinking it's like the first one where if you don't look at it, it doesn't know you're there. But At the same time, I don't think it would be able to smell you because it's a freaking pig. Do I go up or do I go down? Oh, do I go down? Do I go up? Hey, they got ceiling fans. So I don't understand the whole facing that thing. Hear me, Mantis. I am compromised. Our contacts must be brief and occasional. Beware the wretches who populate this compound. The seat is under the pistons. When you meet the saboteur, you will understand everything. <laughs> <laughs> 